Hello, this is Verma. This is the second video in the series in which we explain what a CO2 laser is and how laser machines work. If you missed the first video, you might like to start by watching it to get a better understanding of the topic. And if you watch our videos consistently, please like the video and subscribe to our channel. We do our best for you. After learning what a CNC CO2 laser is in the last video, the next topic to be covered is quite extensive. How does the machine know where to move? CNC stands for Numerical Control, a programming principle that allows moving machine parts to travel along a set path and initiate a laser beam at the required power at the required time. A controller, a special board inside the machine, decides where to move and when to switch on the laser. The laser machine has a display with buttons for adjustment and control. The working area of the machine is similar to a large chessboard with many cells, coordinates. When you load the layout into the machine and put it into operation, the controller starts playing chess with itself, determining from which cell to which one to move and when to turn on the laser to execute the set program. Modern Rueda type controllers are capable of performing both cutting and engraving in a single task. M2 type controllers require a separate task for each type of operation. To make the motors run, the controller sends a signal through a driver, a device that tells the motors in which axis, where and how much to move the gantry or the laser head of the machine. If, during operation, the machine moves the laser head slowly and sets a high power of radiation, we get such an intensive impact on the material that the laser cuts through it. Engraving, on the other hand, requires high travel speed and low power. The machine moves quickly left and right, shifting step by step by about one millimeter, as if it were performing a burning off. The laser head travels at speeds of up to 400 millimeters per second, and the control system has enough time to switch the laser on and off in just the right fraction of a second to produce a high quality image. The laser is used to engrave and cut highly precise shapes and images, thanks to its high resolution and a positioning accuracy of 0.01 mm. Layouts are prepared in vector editors, exported to RD Works, and they are converted to machine-readable code. The cutting or engraving parameters and other settings are set in RD Works, and the machine does everything else. This is exactly how a laser machine works. We hope that we were able to clearly reveal the topic of how a laser machine moves. If you still have questions, write them in the comments and our engineers will be happy to answer them. Also, please like and subscribe to our channel so that you do not miss the next release where we will tell you how the laser beam is formed in CO2 laser machines. This is Verma. See you in the next video.